All right, welcome back, everyone. Uh, we're having a lot of fun here learning mm -hmm. about the uh, Stand Up Comedy Festival happening this weekend. Um, we've got more to talk about. Interested to hear how you guys got those big ads. Get those tickets. Yeah. Tickets.nmu.edu. Have you sold a lot? We have sold a lot. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> I can tell you that uh, Saturdays, both shows are going to be sold out. Yeah. Um, Thursday starting to pile in, Friday starting to pile in. Cool. Um, you know, we want to make emphasis of the family friendly show uh, at Barrel and Beam on Saturday at 6. So bring your families. It's a great time. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, I had a lot of fun last year. So I'm, I'm looking forward to going again. But we wanted to take a moment to, uh, to pause on that and share a little bit about the little. Little Shop of Horrors. Yeah. Yeah, I wanted to make sure I said it right. Because Westwood High School is putting on a, a really cool production of this. It's uh, coming up this weekend, and we stopped by to get a little sne sneak peek. We sent our morning videographer and UMT producer, Rob, over there to yeah. see what he could find. And this is what he put together for us. Take a look.
Ba-bam! There it is. So that's, that's great. Yeah, it was just a little snippet of what you can expect. Uh, we have some information we want to put up on the screen, let you know how you can get tickets. The show is November 3rd and 4th at 7 p.m., and then they have a November 5th performance. That's a Sunday, right, at 1 p.m. That's going to happen right there in the Patriot Performing Arts Theater on Westwood's high school campus. Tickets are $5. You can get them at the door, or you can go to the high school office. I love that name, tickets. Patriot Me Performing too. Arts Theater. It's nice. Yes. Little Shop of Horrors. They've been yeah. working really hard on that. I've seen a couple productions over there at Westwood. They do a really nice job. They do, yeah. yeah. And it's nice to see some of the... I know Gwen was doing some stuff for a while uh, with their theater department. It's nice to see these high schools uh, stepping up the theater yeah. game. And it's yeah. so important to the community. So. It is. And I don't know. There's some really... I've seen some really great high school productions. Mm. Yeah. Could you ever do a production like that? Could you ever do like what Tia's doing? Well, Rocky Horror Show? Probably not. That's a little outside my element. Yeah. But could you? Would you be able to no, like study and like memorize? This, like I just want to sing this, like the, like the national anthem for a hockey game or something. You do? <laughs> yeah. I didn't know that. <laughs> Jennifer's like, no, girl, no. I mean, I just want to try it one time. We can make that happen. I don't know if it would be good though. I'd have to. I'd have to give her a try. Okay. You know what? What you doing? I've heard already. Great. <laughs> what? Yesterday you were singing something here. Oh yeah, I like to sing music from. Evita, have you have you ever watched that? Yeah, yeah, I sing that regularly. But anyway, this okay. we're, we're sidetracking. We don't have time to sidetrack. That's another episode. All right, I'll sing for you later. We're doing a lot of sidetracking today. <laughs> okay, okay, we're we're gonna be back with the uh, crew from the. <laughs> I, I'm, I've lost my train of thought completely. Yes. Stand up comedy festival. We're gonna be back with the crew from the stand up comedy festival after the break. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs>